Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. How are you? How are you feeling? How is life treating you? Hopefully life is treating you well and if not, I do hope things get better. I'm sorry, I keep looking down because I feel like I have lipstick on my teeth and I don't. So welcome. Thank you for being here. Welcome to all everyone who's new. Thank you to everyone who's coming back. Bienvenidos, bienvenidos. Como están todos? Ojalá que todos están bien. Anyways, today we're going to discuss the paint palette. Yes, it came in the mail and I am so happy it's here. I am happy and then I'm not happy, but we'll get to that. I also got, it's actually the whole bundle. I got all of the, um eyelashes so those are here there's five of them and I've got the lippies actually I have the purple one on right now and I actually have the paint palette on I have that on so I did that the lashes are not um, from the collection but the makeup is of course I had to do a monochromatic look because it wouldn't be me if I didn't do a monochromatic look I'm always doing a monochromatic look and I have Fenty Beauty um, a lip gloss and ready to mingle. I always put this over the purples that I have because the purple lipsticks I seem to have are mattes. So, and I actually got two of them. And one was supposed to go to my daughter out in Japan, but let's discuss. So this comes, right, actually I have three. So I'll show you the way it comes. Um, where is it? So they are packaged. Sorry if I'm off camera. Um, so they come packaged like this. Oops, my phone fail. So they come packaged like this. They come in bubble wrap. Each one of them come wrapped in bubble wrap. There's bubble wrap on the bottom and bubble wrap on top. And they come wrapped in plastic. As you can see, you can tell that there's plastic on here by the reflection. And there's plastic. I, I wanna open this one because I wanna see if everything is okay. And I'll tell you what. So I got three of them. I don't know why I ordered three. I ordered one bundle and then two palettes. Each palette runs $45, so it comes this way. Um, and when you open it, see this one is, I don't know if you could tell, you could tell that it's smashed in. It's not supposed to be in. It's supposed to be like that. So that's supposed to be in and that's supposed to be covered. See the difference? Anyways. So this is the first one I opened and I was like, yes, it came. I'm so excited. It comes like that. Comes with the brush. I was just reading a story that she had three different colored brushes and she went with the wooden brush because it reminded her of hers. Then I take this off and bam, look at the orange. Ah, no. Se me rompió. Even with all of the it kind of looks like the splash that's on the palette, the box itself, the paint splash. Pero se me rompió el color, coral. Anyways, they have great customer service, so I'll get back with them and let them know that one of them came damaged. I'm kind of hesitant about opening that one, but I'm going to have to only because I don't want to send my daughter a palette, you know, where she's at. I don't want to send Jocelyn a palette far away. Y luego está quebrada. So at least I know it's good when I send it. And if it breaks on its way there, then, you know, what can you do? So with that being said, so then I opened up my second box. I was like, yes, it's here. So we're going to start out with the paint lipsticks. Um, I love the packaging on the boxes. But like I've always said, I don't like the packaging itself for the lippy. And I tried it on. And... It doesn't taste good. I have it on my lips now only because I went over it with the Fenty Beauty and Fenty Beauty smells really good. It smells like cupcakes. But when I put on this lipstick, it didn't smell too good. I didn't like it. So I'm gonna reach out to them and let them know, hey, it smells weird. Your lippy smells weird. So beautiful packaging, right? Beautiful, purple, beautiful. I said it the last time I got my paint stuff and I that's why I didn't want I I really don't like to get the lippies from them because then you get this and this is like what plain Jane I mean you get a mirror but 
it's still plain and what happens is eventually eventually it starts to wear away this is the one from churros this is what it starts to look like the you know it's just it's not good I don't like it but the smell it smells like oh my god these are gonna hate me for this it smells like not good it smells like chemical I don't like it I, I don't think I would put this on my lips again and I'm gonna reach out to them because it kind of reminds me of it's like petroleum or something it's not even like jelly like g gasoline like it smells bad I don't like it and then the orange one and I gotta smell the orange one so that's what the I mean the colors are nice I've got the purple one on now it's nice it's not an everyday look but it's a nice yeah, see, they smell weird. No. Mm -mm. No, ma'am. I don't like the way they smell. It kind of reminds me of roach spray. Like. I should say bug spray. It don't smell good. I don't like this. I'm going to reach out to them tomorrow and let them know, hey, something ain't right with your... I mean, it's not supposed to smell like paint, <laughs> like turpentine. It's a weird smell. No me gusta. I, I mean, they're beautiful colors, but I'm going to reach out to them because I don't like the way they smell. They don't smell like cupcakes. They don't smell like this one. This is churros. Yeah, see, churros don't even smell. I don't like their doe foot applicators. Yeah, see this one don't even. This one don't smell like that purple one or that orange one. This one smells okay, but I don't like their dough foods. But anyways, that's the colors, the purple. This is that churro one, or I forget what it is. It is, but that's the purple, and that's like what is that coral? I don't know. What's the color on here? Yeah, I don't know. Something in here don't smell right. I I don't like it. That's the color, but it doesn't say the color. It doesn't say like purple or coral. I, I'm assuming it's coral, right? Okay, so now let's get started with the eyelashes. So these are the eyelashes, and they're just called by the by the um, color. So it says, every glam lash is designed and handcrafted using the highest and softest quality. Our 3D lashes are the perfect way to add volume, length, and vers versatility. I can't say that word. <laughs> So your eyelashes and this is purple so that's the back it says purple but the only purple is the not the eyelash itself but the background uh, Sandra was helping me open these and she's like mom are the eyelashes purple like that's the color of the eyelashes and I said no hon it's the it's the color of the inside of just the piece of paper so that's the purple and that's the design those are nice and then this one is red those are real nice man they're so fluffy the only thing I don't like about the um these lashes oh, these look like two different lashes yo or maybe it's the way I'm looking at them tell me those don't look like two different lashes don't they or am I seeing things these look like they're more um so they look more bunched like you could see each section like there's I can count them one two three four five six seven eight nine sections but this one looks more fanned out this one looks fanned out and then this one looks like I gotta put on my glasses so you can, I see what you're seeing so do you see how it looks like there's sections like one two three that section and then this one looks more like fanned out they kind of look like two different lashes. Maybe it's just me seeing things. How about this one? No, this one's fine. The only thing I don't like is their bands. Okay, so then the, this is the orange one. See, these look okay. Those look nice. I don't know, Samia. I'm different. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But that's orange. And then this is yellow no yellow <laughs> this is yellow I, it might be the way I'm looking at them that's yellow 
Does it? Does one look bigger than the other? Like longer? Does this one look longer than this one? I don't know. You let me know in the comment section. Let me know in the comment section. What do you think about these lashes? And then these are the blue. Oh, that's the back. And that's the front. So that's that. And yes, I have my Halloween nails. Uh, I'm trying to get into the spirit of Halloween. So those are the lashes. You get five lashes. You get a two glosses or two, not glosses, two liquid lipsticks. And it was like a hundred and I want to say $15 for the, for everything. And then you get the palette and the palette. It's really nice. The palette itself is $45. I will link the website down below. And there is a, you can use a, a code. I'll list the code down below to save 15% off. So you can save 15% off your, your, um, your eyeshadow. So there it is. There's the brush. This one is the good one. This one was not broken. This is the one I have on my face. So let's take it out. I feel like it's so delicate that I'm going to rip it. You know how like on the Alien pal palette that if you fold it a certain way, you feel like this top piece, like it's a nice piece of a plastic. Okay, so the only thing I don't, I, I, it's a piece of plastic. I don't like this part that it's attached to. It's kind of flimsy, so it can rip. Maybe if this was another, maybe it's just for cost reasons, but if this was a sturdy plastic to go with this, it would have been like, okay. But anyways, that's fine. So you get to flip it over. There's no mirror with this palette. And those are the colors. Now, I... <laughs> It might just be me. I was watching like all these people on Instagram put on this palette. They make it look so easy. Okay. <laughs> I was not having that. <laughs> so it might just be me. Um, but I did go in with like, oh, it's starting to see how it's starting to fade right there. Anyways, I even put on one of like the blue. What color is that? A navy blue. I put it on and it looks purple. And then I added the glitter but I always say it's me it's user error and I'm gonna learn because I was watching these girls on Instagram and they were just putting it on and it was looking so easy and so flawless I'm like how do they do that you know so I'm gonna go ahead and swatch this like I said there it is um this is a $45 palette you are paying in my opinion and I'm entitled to one for the palette what it looks like um because if you have the Morphe James Charles palette, you pretty much have all these colors. At least in my opinion. At least I think so. I'll pull it out right now. Say hi to my sister. Um, not that I wanted to do this. Because that's, I mean, if you can't afford Glam Lights $45 for that palette, you're pretty much... Yeah, you're pretty much, this is almost, almost the same thing. Not quite, but almost. So you, this is the James Charles Morphe palette. And um, you pretty much have all the same colors. So not that I'm knocking Glam Light. They have a beautiful product. The only thing is the price point. This is cheap. I think this is cheaper than like $30. Um, Morphe is cheaper, but anyway, first impressions on the palette. I did have to work the colors. You don't have too many to choose from. Um, so that's that, but it, the pigments are nice. Although I was having a rough time using these. These are the three that I have on my eyes. And then I have these two. And these kind of look similar when placed over the purple. So I was trying to do one eye, one eye, but it came out looking the same. So again, that's my look. And I do have different eyelashes on that, the kind of like one. So let's go ahead and get started. So I'm going to start from here. And we'll go around from the outside. I don't know if else. And then we'll do the inside. Because the insides are all shimmers. Um, so we'll start off with Coral. And Fuchsia. And Purple. They are, they're not soft. They're kind of rough. Some of them are softer than others. Like this blue one, this navy blue seems a little softer than the purple one. And I hear that those are the hard, harder ones to do, right? So we're going to swatch here. So this is coral, and 
this is fuchsia and this is what did I say is this purple Boy, a little see how the colors are and then this is navy swatches are not everything but as you can see they're a little patchy and that's what I was having problems with like this purple it's buildable though you have to go up on it a couple times and so is this fuchsia like you have to really build on it so I'm not gonna do really great swatches because I, I never do I'm just not good at it so that's the those four colors the blue one has a lot more fallout than the rest but yay fingers I wa I tried wiping them down but it's still so we're gonna do royal blue green yellow orange so royal blue that's softer green that's a little rougher Ooh. I'm gonna do yellow with my thumb because my hands a little my hands a little dirty and then orange and red red seems like a rough color too so here we go royal blue um, green green is pretty maybe I'll try a green look tomorrow yellow yellow is not bright at all and I thought it was me trying to put it on my eye there's yellow so I don't know how they got these colors to be so bright maybe they wet their brushes or something orange and red like you have to build up on those so oh my god look at my swatches <laughs> now I'm going crooked <laughs> okay so then uh, burgundy burgundy I put on there brown I know my fingers are still stained I don't know. and black okay so we'll do burgundy here brown and black wow black is black and black is nice see they're kind of I don't know how they did it I really don't if you can tell me down below is it maybe the the um oh my fingers was it something they used as a base to do it that they got these colors to be so pigmented or do you have to like pack on your brush to pack on your eyelid let me know in the comment section i want to keep playing with this palette it's a pretty palette i like it um but wait till you see me swatch the white one okay and i say white because i have trust issues with that white one <laughs> <laughs> you'll know what I'm talking about so now we're gonna swatch the inside so we'll do violet sapphire turquoise light green gold and white one two three four five six fingers so I'll do five and then the last one so there's violet which is kind of rough there's sapphire which they kind of look the same but sapphire has a little bit of the blue tint um, turquoise is really soft oh it's really pretty light green which and gold wow those are kind of nice the shimmers are really really nice and then yellow so we'll do that I'll do violet oh that's pretty and then sapphire but when you put those over purple they look the same um what was this one turquoise light green and gold not gold yeah gold so see those shimmers are really really nice like these are really nice and now I got a new wipe to wipe my hands because I'm not coming off my hand so then I'll do the, the white one now it says white and I knew right away that it wasn't white just by looking at it even before I even tried to swatch it. I actually have it on here in my brow bone. I knew it wasn't going to swatch white. So that says white. Right? It looks white. Does that look white to you? 
Is that in focus? Maybe it looks white there. Does it look white? Watch. Where can I put this? Mm, I'm going to put it here. Is that white? No. That looks gold. It has a tint of gold in it. So, and look at my finger. Can you tell? I mean, it looks yellow in person. I'm not some look. No, it looks yellow. What does it look like on camera? Does it look yellow? I don't know. It looks yellow on my hand. There it is again. And you see the yellow, the one like in the middle? So it it's not white. It's like that trust issues where it says white and then when you swatch it, it swatches like this gold color. So right now I'll be playing with it. Like I said, I played with it to get it on my hand. I'm taking the white one off my hand or whatever color it is. Um, only because I'm gonna grab the palette. But oh crap, look it left a bunch of glitter on my hand. Let me see that. So those are all the colors. I mean, that's nice. Swatches are not everything. Um, I'll have to... The lipsticks are pretty. They smell bad, though. They smell so chemically. And then um, that's the entire palette right there. So it is a matter of playing with it. I got to look to see what these Instagram people do or how they... If they wet the brushes or don't wet the brushes or pack it on. Like, not fan it on. Like, don't use a fluffy brush use more of a packing brush maybe something like this just to stipple it on um because this purple one like but a brush i put it on a brush see even with the brush do i have to pack it on this way to make it get really pigmented because when you do this with a brush and that's this color here that one I mean it doesn't look that purple like it does in the pan so I gotta play with it it's a nice palette it's $45 would I pay $45 for this again probably not um but if you like the palette just to keep like this um because there's no neutrals in this palette there's no transition you have to use all color there's no beige or no white there is no white <laughs> so you have that goldy white color so i mean this is a beautiful palette don't get me wrong it's nice i love the packaging that it came in I, you're pretty much paying for like this um because this was 45 dollars, and this is the way it came and the brush so you get the brush too so i would take 10 dollars off the brush so the palette's like 35 and then this beautiful packaging so this is actually really really nice uh, I'll get to play with it some more I will contact them about my palette but they have great customer service so that I won't you know say anything these they're pretty colors there's the colors again not this one this is the churro one or something um they stink they smell like a chemical and I'm not driving with that because it's not even like something I can tolerate and be like oh okay this not bad it's like a it's a chemical like almost like a gasoline like I said like a bug spray chemical I, I, I don't like it so that is everything in my paint palette thank you for hanging out with me let me know in the comment section did you get this set or did you just get the paint palette itself like I said I have a third one I'm going to open it and um, send that one out to my daughter. I'm going to have them replace that. We'll figure it out. But that's it. Let me know in the comment section. What did you think? I know this video is a little longer than expected. It took me forever to put on my makeup today to actually film a video because I was just not feeling it today. But I, I did my best. Um, let me know what you think of my look. I know it's a monochromatic for some reason. Every time I do looks and every time I sit down and do a look, it seems to be monochromatic. Um, I did like my pink one, then I did an all green one, and it just goes on. So I wanted to try out this purple lipstick, and that's what I put on. But I don't, I guess I don't like smell. And then I got this. This is actually really pretty. Fenty Beauty. And that's what I have on top of. Because I, I don't do well with mattes. My old lips. 
but that's it thank you for hanging out with me like i said comment down comment in the comment section what did you think of everything did you get the set did you get the lashes i'm sharing these lashes with jocelyn so she will be getting some and i will be keeping some but let me know what did you think of the lashes did they look different to you too or was it just me maybe it's just me um i don't know it just looks so different but anyways i have rattled on long enough taken a lot of your time so thank you thank you thank you so much for being here i truly appreciate it i am so close that oh, these are it oh, let me know in the comment section um but yeah um i'm so close to 1500 so i could do my little mini giveaway um my uh little surprise surprise so yeah comment down below let me know what's going on and i will see you on the next one hasta later